last year when you were here in Covina, um, you prayed for me. And a year and a half ago, my right lung had collapsed. It had pretty much burst. And I had to have emergency surgery where part of my lung was removed. I couldn't breathe. I was a very different person. And when I came to one of your meetings, um, I was completely healed. And you said that God gave you a vision that he gave me a new lung. So how did your lung collapse? Um, just spontaneously, no reason. Doctors couldn't find a reason of, as to why it happened. At the time of prayer, I couldn't breathe. I had incredible pain, the right side of my chest. Um, I was pretty much just hunching over, and I couldn't even lift up my one-year-old baby. I remember you, and I remember saying, the Lord's given you a new lung. Yes. So what did you feel happened when God gave you a new lung? Fire. There was fire, and it felt like it was exiting my body. Um, what was exiting your body? I think probably things that I was holding on to. So you felt this fire going through you, and then when did you start breathing through your right lung? Immediately. Wow. What was it like, you know, you couldn't breathe in your lung, and suddenly you can breathe? It was incredible. <laughs> There's not, no, wow. no feeling like it. Wow. So you want to show us how you can breathe deeply? I couldn't even lift my arms. Wow. So I what you can do now. Oh, I can do so much. And I carry my two and a half year old now and I play wow. with her in the park. <laughs> wow. God. God is good. I'm here because God is good. So before you couldn't hold your baby? No, I couldn't. I couldn't hold my baby. I couldn't take care of my baby. I needed people to take care of me. So physically, what can you do? Oh, um, I, I can do stretches and I can, like I said, take care of my baby and take care of my family and live the life that God wants me to live. And you know in heaven that there's spare parts, their lungs and hearts. So you received a heavenly lung, okay? And it was put in by angels, okay? So... When I look at you spiritually, you're not the same person as you were before because you are now a temple of praise, of thanksgiving and gratitude, and you will be for the rest of your life. You are marked as a person of praise. Amen. You know, if you went back to the doctor and if they examined that lung, they'd be very surprised because it is not the same lung that they saw. I'm telling you, it's not the same. It's a different lung. It's a new lung. It's a heavenly lung. Amen. Amen. <laughs>